At this time, I'd like to present the prestigious James O. Page GEMS Leadership Award. The James O. Page Leadership Award, sponsored by Hartwell Medical, recognizes an individual organization who exhibits the drive and tenacious effort to resolve important EMS issues or bring about positive change in an EMS system, often at great personal or professional sacrifice. Please welcome to the stage Mr. Gary Williams, President of Hartwell Medical, joined by two very special individuals who've been so closely involved in both supporting and mentoring this year's award recipient, the one and only Dr. Ronald Stewart, Professor of Emergency Medicine, Dalhousie University, Faculty of Medicine and Officer of the Order of Canada, and the one and only Dr. Baxter Larman, Professor of Emergency Medicine at the David Griffin School of Medicine at UCLA, and recently retired and very happy Director of the Center for Pre-Hospital Emergency Care, Mr. Gary Williams. Thank you, AJ. It is a distinct, distinct pleasure to be here today and share the stage with Dr. Ron Stewart and Dr. Baxter Larman, two pioneers in their own right in the development of EMS as we know it today. I first met Jim Page when he spoke at the NAMT annual meeting sponsored by Kent State University, and that was some 40 years ago. It was immediately apparent that Jim had a passion for this emergency care business, and he was on a mission to help every organization he could, no matter how big or how small. I had the pleasure of working alongside Jim in the early days at GEMS. Jim was a fighter and a crusader, and he was always looking to improve, and he was never satisfied with the most recent accomplishment. The James O. Page GEMS Leadership Award honors those individuals that advance the state of the art of EMS through their innovative thinking, their ability to lead others in the face of adversity, and a level of dedication to their craft that is not often recognized. We are here today to honor Dr. Walt Stoy. Dr. Stoy has been at the forefront of EMS, EMS education for decades, and his accomplishments in the field of emergency care are many, as you will see in the accompanying video. You may notice, though, that um, Dr. Stoy, in his photos, you don't see him smile very much. Some say that's because of his awesome mustache, okay? But Dr. Stoy is more like Clark Kent. He is the mild-mannered professor that goes about his business without a lot of fanfare. He is simply a solid performer, and he always comes through in crunch time. Titles are not important to Walt, results are. Dr. Stoy is also a very generous person, always taking the time to talk to any caregiver that has a story to tell or a suggestion to offer, a trait that Jim Page was a master at. With such a low-key, hard-working individual, it did take a little digging to find a rare, humorous event to share with everybody today. It was many years ago when Dr. Stoy and Dr. Stoy's next-door neighbor's families traveled to no Nova Scotia to visit Dr. Stewart. This was on North Island, and it was a rough, rocky road to get down to Dr. Stewart's home. Seeing that there could be the potential for some scrapes along the way, Dr. Stoy took to the rear bumper of one of the vehicles okay, to get a better vantage point. Standing on the back bumper, he shouted out directions for the safe passage of both families down to Dr. Stewart's home. As Dr. Stewart would say, even then he was displaying his great leadership skills. At this time, please welcome the 2018 James O. Page GEMS Leadership Award recipient, Dr. Walt Stoy. <laughs> 